And our next recipient of the Quilly Award, Jim Cathcart, The Will to Win. Hi, I'm JJ Snyder reporting from the 2018 Golden Gala Awards in Hollywood, California. I'm here with Jim Cathcart, who's just stepped off stage with his Quilly. Congratulations. Hey, thank you. Yeah, it's exciting. You've done it. Quite an accomplishment. My 19th book. No kidding. Seriously. Really? Yeah, 19. Oh my gosh, that so is tremendous. Gray hairs, they're real. <laughs> Honest to God. I just see 19 of them, so you're doing pretty well, yes. Tell me all about your contribution. This has been a very exciting process. The, the will to win. The book is The Will to Win. Everybody has the will to win. Or not, Let me take that back. Everybody has the desire to win. But the will to win means the will to endure, the will to put up with a lot of disappointment, the will to keep on working when you don't see whether it's going to pay off yet the will to resist the temptation to do other things. You know, there's a whole lot of wills that add up to winning, and it's not just wanting to win. That is so true. That is so true. Well, the, the biggest difference in the world between people that don't achieve much and people that do is the people that do decide to do it. They don't decide to try it they decide to do it. It's like years ago I weighed 200 pounds, this is 150. Did you truly, did you truly, pounds. this man weighed 200 pounds? I did. And I had tried dieting quite a few times and it was always successful and I was still fat. And so I said, okay, I decide today, January 25th, 1974, but who's counting? I said, today I will become a slender person and remain one for the rest of my life. And I have. Becoming a slender person is different from losing weight. Losing weight is just part of the journey. Yes. Being a slender person, thinking like one, acting like one, you know, that's the thing. That's like the will to win. Whatever your challenge is, choose to actually make it happen. And people say, well, but what if it's hard? Then it's hard. What if it hurts a lot? Then it hurts a lot. If you choose to do it, you're going to do it and put up with whatever you have to to get there. Wow. I, I, I'm sorry. I still can't believe you're 200 pounds. <laughs> I'm like, what? How did he do this? Um, but I, 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 was, I was overweight as well. And I will tell you, there's nothing better than the feeling, the feeling of being thin. Like, I, you know, I'm not overweight the, uh, anymore. It's classic. I think it's Weight Watchers is known for this line. Nothing tastes as good as slender feels. Whoa. Absolutely. I still love to eat, but you know, you, yeah, so do I. you, you figure out, you, you persist yep. and you figure out what combination of things you need to do to, to make your dream happen. The same thing's true in business. Same thing's true in money. Same thing's true in relationships. Yeah. Yeah. What a formula you've come up with here, my friend. Congratulations tonight. Yes. Great to be with Hold you. Hold up that quilly. Show it off. 19 books. What?